Do you want to create your own children's book or animated story without writing or illustrating everything from scratch? With Red Kids AI, it helps you build picture books and story videos in minutes, and you can upload your finished videos directly to YouTube without worrying about copyright content or even list them on Amazon KDP to earn publishing revenue. So today we're diving into Read Kids, an AI-powered platform that's opening up a whole new way to tell stories. Whether you're a parent wanting to create personalized bedtime books or an educator looking to bring your lessons to life, this tool makes it easy and exciting. Let me show you how simple it is right now. The first thing you need to do is get an account. I'll put the link down below in the description so you can sign up for free and test this out. When you get logged into Redkiz, as a new user, you can receive 1,500 points, so you can use it for free. And each day you sign in, you also get a bonus of 200 points, which can give you lots of space to experience it totally free before you take the next step further. Even more excitingly, Red Kids regularly hosts events. This month features a script writing competition with cash prizes. The event is genuine and legitimate. Win up to $100 in cash. If you're interested, click the event link below for full details. On the homepage, you can see that they make it it's super easy to get started with creating your books. Here you can see the featured section where you can create picture books by age from 3 to 6 or even for children from 12 to 14. If you scroll down a bit, you're going to see drawing styles here. It's a new feature where you just pick a style right here and create similar results. Next, you're going to see different things where you can even explore some of the hot new releases which have lots of styles and ideas for you to get inspiration from. From what I'm seeing now, just on the homepage, I'm really impressed with how Red Kids makes everything look very professional and polished. If you want to dig a little further, check out the explore section by clicking here and look at the results from other user creations. You can check out image styles, books, or caricatures. This will give you more good ideas of what you can create with Read Kids and the different styles. Now, if you go to My Creations, this is where your books will get stored. You can start to create a new book by clicking here. If you click on here, you can print digital books into a physical book. You can also find other feature functions on the left menu bar. There are lots of things for you to explore. For now, let me go through step by step to create a new one to show you how this is done. Let's go back to My Creations and create a new book by clicking right here. To start, we just need to enter a brief story description. Now you could choose one of these, and if you didn't like one of them, you could click change and choose a different one. But now, I am going to add my own description. It's a children's Halloween story about Mia, her puppy, and a pumpkin. For this type of content, I am going to choose the age group from 4 to 6 years. Here, I am going to choose stories, then friendship. And, for narrative style setting, I'll also leave the default for third-person perspective. If you want the animals in the story to have human characteristics, you can select anthropomorphic. If not, just select non-anthropomorphic. And this is the ratio. You can keep it at 1 to 1, but for now, I'll choose 16 to 9. Let's go ahead and generate this. Now it went through and wrote a story for you. So you can see as you go through, it could go up to 10,000 characters. But, this is good enough for now. Now, I am going to extract the roles from this. When I go through, you can see this step for choosing a style. You can pick any style that fits your vision. For now, I'm going to pick the second style. It's like a 3D render style, which is very trending, so this would be a really good one for me to try. Now in this screen, you can click the small edit icon here, or you can click the edit character button at the bottom right of the screen for changing character properties. You can change gender, category, age, or other things like skin, hair color, hairstyle, facial features, or even accessories, and clothing. By default, Read Kids has already set up everything for you by matching with the story generated from the previous step and the drawing style you have chosen. So I will not change anything, and let's see how it goes with the default settings. Very impressive, right? Let's review them one by one and just choose the one with the best quality. Otherwise, you can click Generate again, so you can have many other options. Next, I'm going to do the same for the supporting character. For this one, it's the dog character, mapped to the role in my original story. This time, I'll try adding an accessory to the dog. Let's go with a cute witch hat to match my Hollow Queen story. Everything else, I'll just leave as default. Click on Confirm and then click Generate for Red Kids to generate images. While waiting for the images to generate, you can go to Group Performance and generate it if you want. Let's review both the supporting character and group performance images. Everything is perfect because the Red Kids app is optimized for book content, so each image aligns very well with the style. You don't have to spend too much time, but you still get very good results. After having and selecting good results, just click Next so we can head over to Storyboards. You can review everything in here, but most of the time, you never have to do that. Everything will be polished for you, as I already review all of them. Now it's time to start generating images for each page. In this screen, just wait a little bit, and at the top of the page, you can see the percentage status. 
On the first page, as you can see, I already generate some great images, and I'll guide you on how to do this in the next steps. If I like any image, I just need to click Apply to Canvas to apply it to the current page. Now, I'll change the font and color so the text is more visible. If it's a cover page, you can click on Cover Font here, choose your style, then drag, drop, and rescale it so it looks more polished, like what I'm doing here. It's really simple, as you can see. Now just click on the next page, and as you can see, the support character also appears with the main character on the right, so this page will have both characters in the same image. Just click Generate, and you don't have to wait. Just head over to the next page and we can generate all of these images at the same time. When you don't see any character on the right, this means the image is the scene only. Everything is ordered so you can polish the story from start to finish. And after generating everything, edit the text, color and font, drag and drop, so it's well ordered. I already have everything I need for images and designing. Next, let's click on the microphone icon at the bottom, so you can choose the voiceover. I checked most of the voices that Red Kids currently supports, and they're all very high quality. Let me listen to some together. Hello. Welcome to Read Kids. Hello, welcome to Read Kids, a world full of imagination and childlike fun. Now I'm going to select this voice. You can change each page's voice, and by selecting Change All Voice Actors here, you can change all pages with the same voice. Next, just select the pages you want to generate voiceovers for and click Generate. If you want to generate all page voiceovers, just repeat like that, all easier steps. The little pumpkin that shined bright. On a blustery Halloween night, Little Mia tiptoed outside, her puppy Fizz wagging at her heels. They were supposed to- After that, you also have many options right here. You can change the background music, you can upload your own images, or you can change the background image of each page if you like that. After everything, then to generate the video, just click on Generate Video, and then click Generate Video one more time. Then the settings pop-up will appear. You can select Firefly's effects like I'm doing here. Select Animation and select Background Music. After that, click Generate for Video Generation. You should wait about 5 to 10 minutes. And while waiting, you can explore other features. Now let's see the final result I have while making this tutorial. And that's it. Turning a simple idea into a beautiful picture book and a full animated story really can be this easy with Read Kids. If you want to try it yourself, tap the link in the description, sign up free, and start building your first book or video today. And yeah, don't forget to join the cash prize activity with Read Kids. Thanks for hanging out with me until now. I'm excited to see what you make. Happy creating, and I'll see you in the next one.